Yeah. So. But what's most important about this fossil is it has preserved very well uh, preserved uh, dentition. It also has some ankle bones and also some wrist bones of the hand. And these are the critical parts that tell us that this fossil is closely related to the modern marsupials. And around this fossil, you can tell that there are fossilized furs going around the skeleton. So this is one of the best preserved marsupial skeletons from the age of the dinosaurs. All right, what we are looking at here is the world's earliest marsupial relatives. Believe it or not, this whole fossil is 125 million years old. But uh, despite the fact of its age, it's very well preserved. Here you can see a complete skeleton, and you can see some cartilage are well preserved. Around the skeleton, we have some carbonized impression of furs. So this little critter, size of a mouse or chipmunk, it has a uh, very well preserved jaws and its anterior teeth and its ankle joint and also the wrist indicate it's a marsupial relative. Well, by incorporating fossil evidence with comparative morphology of modern mammals together, we have figured out the evolutionary history of all marsupials in the study associated with this early mammal from China. And what we've discovered is that uh, marsupial relatives first appeared in China or in Asia 125 million years ago. And from there, they spread into North America and then on into South America after the uh, extinction of the dinosaurs 65 million years ago. And what's unusual about this, of course, is that in Asia today, there are no living marsupials. So their earliest relatives were there in Asia. And then there are none of them left after about, I guess, about 80 million years ago was when That's the last right. marsupial was known from there. That's the tricky part of the elbow. Uh -huh. And that's the tricky part of the wrist. And these are the fingers of the hand.